Anne and Byron positioned themselves 35 meters apart on one side of a stream. Here they are, 35 meters apart. Anne measured the angles as shown below. So we have some triangles here, right angle triangles. 36 degrees here and looking up, looking up towards this cliff is going to be 68 degrees. This may not look like 68 degrees, it looks a lot smaller, but this is just because we're looking uh, at a, from a certain perspective. Calculate the height of the cliff on the other side of the stream. So we're trying to solve for h, the height of this triangle here. But we only have one angle, we don't have any of the sides. We don't have enough information. So we need to solve this side here to actually solve for, for it. So to solve this side here, we can do it because it's connected to this triangle here. So let's solve this triangle first. We'll just call this uh, C. Can we solve for length C? Now we, we have this angle here. We have this adjacent here. This is also a right angle triangle. We're interested in the hypotenuse and the adjacent. So when we uh, write down so ka toa, we're interested in the adjacent and the hypotenuse. Adjacent, hypotenuse. We're going to use cosine. Cos 36 degrees, that's this angle here, is equals to adjacent over hypotenuse, which is 35 over C. So we can solve for C by cross multiplying. We can say that the same thing as over 1, 1 times 35 is 35, and then C times cos 36 is like this, and we can divide both sides by cos 36. So we have 35 over cos 36 degrees. So making sure that we're in degree mode, we have 35 divided by cos 36 is 43 approximately. C is approximately equals to 43.262. So we solve for C. Now that we solve for C, we can solve for H. We're interested in the adjacent and the opposite. We're interested in the adjacent and the opposite. So we're going to use the tan ratio now for 68 degrees. So tan 68 equals opposite over adjacent, which is H over adjacent, which is 43.262. Multiply both sides by the denominator here, and we have the answer. H is approximately equals to 43.262 tan 68 degrees. So it's going to be this number, 43.262 blah blah, times tan of 68 equals 107. So h is approximately equals to 107.08 meters. And the closest answer to that is choice D. D is our final answer.